Climate change means that we will need to change the way we live in the future, and not just as individuals, but as communities too. Adaptation options are almost always implemented locally, providing direct benefits to local populations as well as indirect benefits to those connected to the region. Here are three changes some communities have already made that you could see where you live in the future. Roads in towns and cities are normally made of non-absorbent concrete or tarmac. In the future, we could see the introduction of permeable surfaces and green infrastructure like trees and rain gardens to reduce the risk of flooding. We could also see improvements to public transport across the country. This would reduce the need for cars and reduce carbon emissions. Fewer cars also means fewer car parks, so these can be replaced with green spaces. Finally, we will need to start making changes to buildings to make sure they are climate ready. Buildings will need to have better ventilation to cope with overheating and damp. As the effects of climate change become more extreme, it's important to consider how we will need to adapt and how this relates to mitigation or reducing emissions to help reach and go beyond a net zero goal. Mitigation and adaptation are the key tools available to us in order to avoid the worst climate impacts on people, infrastructure and nature. However, ideally we need to make changes in ways that enhance other development goals, including reducing poverty and inequality, promoting good governance and improving well-being to create a better future for everyone. If you would like to find out more about adaptation, check out the description for links to more resources or alternatively, you can search Get Climate Ready on the Met Office website.